Again, human beings from the planet Earth. Well, you saw this page last night, but evidently uh, my mic was muted or something. I, I was pissed off and tired, so those are never a good combination. Anyway, this information was put out by HealOnline.org, and thank them for that because, uh, well, I'm going to show you. This should horrify you, and I'm hoping that you'll all pull together and start supporting the Op Liberation tag on Twitter and uh, all the other activists that fight institutional abuse. Uh, on our teens. Anyway, I'm going to read this to you. We advise current and or former staff to report any abuses you may have witnessed while working at Diamond Ranch Academy. For uh, information on your rights and how to take action, visit heal-online.org, blow the whistle, HTM. I'll link you to this. You guys can pick up these links if you wish. Uh, if you were fired or forced to resign because you opposed any legal and or unethical practices at Diamond Ranch Academy, you may have the right to take action. If you were harmed, family or survivor, by Diamond Ranch Academy, please contact info at heal-online.org. If you remember the long-term employees and from which years, this will help. Also, if you recognize any of these staff having worked at other programs, send any information about their past or present employment to other facilities and or cults. Um, this is, uh, I want you to make note here, folks, that the majority of the staff at Diamond Ranch Academy, uh, the link to their website will be below, um, it, most of their staff is untrained, unlicensed. Okay, and one thing that I did leave out yesterday, so I'm glad the sound was off, is uh, the information at the bottom of this. As we go through, you'll see all these dark ones are, are uh, no license, no license, mental or medical. Mental or medical, no license, no license, no license, no license, no license. And there's one that's real uh, disturbing down here. Let's see this. Uh, one of these guys is in charge of the isolation ward. And, uh, yeah, right here, Shane Johnson, supervisor of isolation. Johnson is not a licensed mental health nor medical professional in Utah. And the source is there, so you can confirm. This is a serious concern given Johnson's position in supervising the isolation unit. The U.S. Department of Health and Human Services requires that mental health medical professionals be in charge and supervise any use of isolation. So, okay, parents, you, your teen's out of line, he's mouthy or she, and, and you can't handle it, and you're going to send him away to somebody that, assures you they are going to modify their behavior. Then they put them in isolation, unlicensed, untrained. What, what modification of the behavior is going to occur? Certainly not positive, possibly death. Okay? This is running rampant in this country, and others uh, as well, but my knowledge is the stuff that's going on here for the most part. These people are not licensed, folks. And, and they're uh, modifying the behavior of, of what are labeled as troubled teens? Really? And, and the marketing campaign that goes behind these uh, institutions, especially Diamond Ranch Academy, uh, to manipulate the parents. Now, I want you to keep in mind that you just saw... Uh, at least 75%, I'm going to guesstimate. I didn't do the count. You can when I link you to it. About 75% of these people are untrained, unlicensed. Now, here we go for the recent police calls. Notice the number of assaults in breathing. And a citizen assistant, you, your kids are being restrained by people that don't even work for Diamond Ranch Academy, let alone, they're not licensed, but some of the kids that do well, bow down well, more likely, play the game well, they, they get to restrain the other children who haven't quite bowed down yet. Look at all these calls recently to a staff that is fully untrained. Anyway, uh, 
you gotta you gotta see the um, now I put this again I put this up last night so uh, none of you guys could hear it so I want to bring you over to Diamond Ranch Academy real quick I'll link you to all this stuff all right uh, I want to show you what the what their uh, little propaganda slogan is here like your child unique one of a kind no, you're not fucking one of a kind. These, these haphazard bastards can, uh, are a dime a dozen. They're everywhere. They're unlicensed. They're untrained. They're uneducated in the fields that, that they're working in. And we're talking about our youths. We're talking about physical abuse, isolation, untrained. You can't call them professionals. So anyway, the number to Diamond Ranch Academy is right here. And following this video, you will rehear me calling them last night. Give them a call. Let them know that we know and that we're going to work until they are shut down. Much love. Many thanks. All links will be below. Back with you human beings. Uh, in the first half of this video, I had asked you to call Diamond Ranch Academy. These vile bastards. And uh, I was so pissed off. Normally, I don't ask you to do anything that I haven't already done myself. So I decided before I process that portion of the video, I was going to tie this into it and show you. Here's the number, 877-372-5250. Uh, you'll see. And uh, I don't know if they're going to answer the phone. It's, it's 9.30 p.m. Uh, East Coast time, so it's just after 6 on the West Coast. Uh, let's see if these bastards, because they're going to know uh, that we know and, and that they can expect us. Uh, this is enough of the bullshit. Absolute enough of the bullshit. Ranch Academy, this is Dan. Yes, Dan. My name is Kevin Allen from MasterOfManyThings.com. I'm Alternative Media. How are you? Uh, well, I, I'm I'm pretty upset. You know, I've been watching you guys in the whole industry for a long time, and the information that was just released to me um, is is very disturbing. I understand that better than half of your staff is not licensed in medical uh, profession in any way or mental health, and that you have somebody that is unlicensed supervising your uh, isolation ward, which um, is, is a very disturbing fact. And I just want you to know, as a source of alternative, alternative media, that I know, and my subscribers, and my Twitter followers, and my Facebookers, and all those people are going to know, and you'll probably get other calls, and we're going to do our very best to shut your vile institution down. Sir, you have been notified.